Hi, I'm Henry Watson. I'm a wood carving artist from Livonia, Louisiana. But I grew up in a little area called Val Verde, which is about three miles away from Livonia. Most people don't know of it because it was a small village town, but it's with my hometown. We are now in my studio in Livonia, Louisiana, where I take three-dimensional, where I do three-dimensional wood carving from old cypress wood. These are boards that you find from old byways and back roads to Louisiana, come off of old barns. Most of them was old slave cabins. I take those and I recreate scenes that once was. I call the bygone days of Louisiana. I started off at a tender age around 15. And as I knew that I had a little art talent, drawing stick animals and all of that, I happened to be fortunate enough to go to Livonia High School. At Livonia High School, we started learning how to take simple tools and chisels and carving names, the Johnson, the Williams, and did it for people, camps and all. And from carving names, we went to doing little buildings. And of course, all that was around me was trees and little buildings and cabins, because that was the area I grew up. So I started capturing what I saw and what I knew. This particular piece is a general scene that you would see up and down the byways of Louisiana at any point in any time back in the day, before the days of cars and automobiles. And you'll see these little trails and these big oak trees and when normally you saw the big trees, it was some type of life, either a house, a cabin, farm, work, or something, because we didn't have air conditioning and the big trees sheltered you from the sun and gave you the shade that you needed in those days. Actually, I would carve it three-dimensional with chisels like these, and I'll actually hand carve it in three-dimensional, foreground, middle ground, and background. And once you carve it in and then get to the point of painting it, you gotta make this cabinet all stand out. So Keep your eyes on a cabin scene here, and then you can see what an actual cabin scene will look like once it's completed. So along the back roads of Louisiana, you will also find the plantation homes that I created and carved. And these carvings of various plantations is done three d as well. I like the outdoors and the part of my art is I like seeing the trees, the moths, and also give me that feeling of knowing that life existed where people live, where people work. And we're talking again back in the days before you had automobiles and planes where people could get from one city to the next in a matter of hours. So along those routes to get from here to there, people live, they settle, they build, they farm. That would interest me the most, you know, how people live, where they came from, you know, along these byways and back roads. And I recreate that past that's probably it could never be recreated again. Also, sometimes it's the love of what a customer wants. I, I had people call and said, back in my day, we always had this little pig, and I remember it from there, and that's what stuck in their mind as they grew up was, we had this pig on the farm. And then they'll come and say, this is the picture of me with the pig. Now you capture that, you just capture his whole world. You know, may not mean nothing to nobody else, but to him, it means everything. And I, I strive on doing those kind of things. Not just something that somebody say, oh, you ought to go capture this. I like to capture something that means something to somebody, you know.